Hey students, so this is the last time I'm saying hi to you um, and I would like to give you an overview of what um, you will be doing in this final week of the course. So the first thing or the function of this last week is revision. This means you are going to look at many of the words again and many of the concepts again that um, you have covered and that you've learned in the course, okay? The second thing that is also quite important for me is an application. So far we have looked at many theoretical concepts in the course and here finally I would like you to apply these concepts. So the first area of application is in the field of biomedical engineering. Biomedical engineering deals with many different fields. For example, devices that look into the human body, um, medical imaging techniques, um, but also, for example, prosthetic devices. And this is our field. So if a person has lost a limb, for example, an arm or a leg, so what can engineers do to help these people? And this is the field um, that we are going to look at. And it's an extremely interesting field. I hope you will enjoy this application. The second application in this course is wind power or wind energy. So we are going to revisit the renewable um, forms of energy again that you had in the second week. Um, what you will now be doing is look at the parts and the components of a wind turbine, um, look at the concept of how actually wind is uh, turned into energy that we can use, electrical energy, and this is also an extremely interesting field. There is one new topic that's a little bit introduced here and this is the wild field of transmission of um, power. So you, you will learn hopefully three, four, five new words in this part. Okay, so enjoy the application part and um, also maybe you find one of the fields of engineering that fascinates you and that you want to work in once you have become an engineer. I'm saying goodbye and wish you lots of success in the rest of the course.